Hello and welcome to a quick video tutorial on how to import content into your Canvas course. We are going to look at two common ways to do an import. The first is to import from one of the other courses we have in our course list. The second is to import a copy of a full course from Canvas Commons. Let's look at copying one of our own courses. Go to the course you want to bring the content into. We go to Settings, then look on the side for a button that says Import Content. This will bring us to a page where we can choose what kind of import we want. To copy from our own courses, we choose Copy a Canvas Course. We should keep in mind that this copying and importing process can be as little or as much of the origin course as we want. We can copy one quiz over, all assignments, just the discussion boards, or everything. Once we choose to copy over only selected content, it almost always appears as if we're done, but there's still more to do. We need to select the content to copy over. We can use the checkboxes to mark which items we want to copy over. Once it's marked, we click the button and the process now runs automatically in the background. We could even close this tab if we needed to and move on to something else. Depending on the amount of data that's being copied over, this could take just a minute or several. Now let's look at going to Canvas Commons to import content. Look for the button on the side that says Commons. Oftentimes, you'll find templates to start with, or even a full, complete course. Once in the Commons area, we can try to filter down to the content more specific to our needs. Let's look for a template to get a course started. Let's also limit our search to content specifically shared within our district by checking this box here. I found what I want. Now I click the button to choose to transfer it into a course or download a common cartridge file to then import later. Let's go ahead and transfer the template into one of our courses. After clicking to confirm, the process is again automatic, and we can close this window if we choose. Once content is transferred into the course that we want, we can edit the copied content however we see fit. That's all for now. Check out our other videos and related materials to help you with your instructional technology needs.